Benidorm enthusiast here with Benidorm Stuff YouTube channel. I'm here at the Town Hall Square today where a protest rally is taking place. Buenos días. Agradecer a toda la hostelería y el comercio de Benidorm, sobre todo a quienes habéis hecho. A Breca, which is the association of bars, restaurants and cafes in Benidorm, has called on the businesses to strike today and join together in the protest rally that's happening here now. Every passing day, more businesses close their doors. Behind these businesses are thousands of people losing their jobs, families losing their income. The hospitality sector feels abandoned, having received very little help from the government to survive the pandemic. The crisis has hit the Benidorm area particularly hard. As most of you know, the whole city, restaurants, bars, cafes, shops, hotels, tour and excursion companies, breweries, food and drink distributors, laundry services, the list goes on and on and all of these are heavily reliant on tourism, which has at the moment come to a standstill. from the government in the form of tax reductions and exemptions for social security payments. At the absolute minimum, these financial burdens could be lifted for the businesses fighting to survive to help them be able to pull through this terrible situation. Abreca have joined with ICO, which is the Association for Shops, Services and Self-Employed, in this initiative and, are, and have invited all businesses in the sector to cease their activity as a sign of protest and participate in the rally today. Meeting here at the Town Hall Square, where a manifesto will be read out about the agonising situation affecting everybody right now from entrepreneurs, business owners, to their employees and their families. Eh, es cierto, Benidorm se muere, el comercio se muere y la hostelería se muere. Por todo ello solicitamos al gobierno nacional, autonómico y también eh, municipal en este caso, it's a good turnout. I can see lots of faces I recognise from all different parts of the spectrum. I'm here with Lee from the Pig and Whistle. Lee, what does it mean for you to be here today? Uh, means very, very much because of the situation I find myself in after seven months, still with no help from the government, being open, only open to be able to open five months, uh, five months, with five, five weeks, nice. five weeks uh, in the whole of this year. Uh, with the restaurant now capacity only 12 and only two or four on the outside, it's not possible to carry on there. So this newest movement has actually closed the restaurant now as well for the short term. And how are you thinking that it's going to make a difference? Are you hopeful? Today I'm not sure things will ever make a difference, but to be part of it, maybe the media like yourself can get this spread and shared wide. Well, maybe we can um, get something action off of the government. We have Who to knows? try. Who knows? It's not about, it's not about um, making a difference today but I'm actually here to ask them or, or to speak my word and that's we need help now we, we need help to yeah. save the sector and the sector will go under within the next three months there'll be nothing left no exactly as it was today everyone's turned up no one's open there's not one shop to buy a coffee today in that street on the way here this is what people in Benidorm and across the, 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 the Costa Blanca across Spain should realize if this continues this town will look like it just did just now when we walk through it really? I take a video earlier on of everything and I'll be putting that on later this could be the way of life now with no bars, cafes, restaurants, open. We can't let it happen, we have to at least try and make change. Yeah, let's, let's try and uh, fight through this and see the winter through and hopefully better times will come. But at the moment things are looking bleak. Things, there's never any good news like there was before. There was always like a little light at the end of the tunnel. Right now I'm feeling like there is not no good news coming through. Yeah, it's difficult. Yeah. It's difficult. Thanks for your time. No worries, no worries. No All worries. the best. Yeah. The restrictions constantly being placed upon these sectors are effectively strangling the companies, making it near impossible to function as a business. Action is needed to help them see this through or there will be nothing left. Animadora turística del inserso, por favor. No, venidor es seguro. Se puede venir aquí a veranear. Todo el mundo con la tercera edad y mis chicos y chicas de oro. Arriba venidor. Arriba. Yeah. 
what an absolute nightmare situation we are in. Thanks for watching guys, please leave us a comment, let us know your thoughts and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Like and follow us on Facebook, Twitter and Instagram at the Benidorm Enthusiast. Stay positive and stay safe.